Hey, what's up, everyone? This is Phantom again, a little more video for Pokemon TCG Card Collection. Sorry if you have like this sounds kind of weird because it's like it's raining a lot outside right now because it was super hot and now it's not raining for nowhere. Um, but today we have a reveal officially reveal for the new series of the Pokemon Card Collection will be like Sword and Shield Fusion Strike. And the team for the the this collection will be like Mew in the in the on the cover for art, uh, and uh, we're gonna have. Over like 260 cards, you're gonna have 20 Pokemon V and 13 full art Pokemon V. Also, this num this art normally is super cool. I love it. Uh, we're gonna have eight Pokemon V Max, uh, 20 trainer cards, and seven full art super uh, supporter cards. Okay, you want a special energy card. So this is the what I'm gonna have for this collection, and I'm super hyped for. Uh, now let's talk about what we're gonna have for this collection. For this collection, we're gonna have two different blisters. Uh, we're gonna have the first blister. We're gonna have a Japanese uh, uh, Japanese Espion, and they come with extra, extra uh, three blisters in the same pack. The second blister we have is the Japanese uh, Eevee, and he comes also with three blisters. I believe they're gonna be cost around fifteen dollars. I believe this collection, so can't wait for that. Uh, next one, we're gonna have three different, uh, four different blisters basically. Gonna have a, the first blister is for Bizzle. They come with the one blister card, one coin, and the, the Pokemon card. Second one we're gonna have for Tepigi, one blister, one card, and the next two ones gonna be for uh, Gronky and Scorn Bunny. They come with the three cards evolution for the each step evolution, and one blister in one coin each. So this is pretty cool right there. We're gonna have a lot of uh, options. Uh, of course, we have the classic like 36 box. Um, a booster ba uh, booster box, so we're gonna have 336 packs booster box. Uh, I'm gonna get there for sure. We have some images for the the artwork for the packs. Normally, it's four different styles. Um, we have the hard cover like a blister, like everybody saw already. This is like, I I don't know why they have this hard cover because I, I basically like start collecting Pokemon cards again recently, so I don't know why they have different uh, this hard cover blisters. I believe it's for protect like in stores maybe uh we also we're gonna have the build uh building battle uh deck it's pretty cool i love the design art for uh me win the front of the box it's super cool uh i don't play pokemon cards the uh um the card game i just collected the cards but i might get this one here just because the box is super cool uh we're gonna have the beetle um build and battle stadium from uh for me, they're gonna come inside. They're gonna come two uh, build battles decks plus four blisters and two, uh, one coin for here, one for poison, right there. So that's pretty cool. Is this hat? I believe this hat is gonna cost from forty uh, to seventy dollars, probably, and the exact price. Because I don't know if the other uh, editions we have they have a different price in between. So uh, I'm not sure 100% uh, about that. Uh, the little trainer box is going to have two versions, one is going to be blue uh, mixed with uh, purple and the other one going to be mixed uh, purple with um, pink. So we're going to have these two versions for the little trainer box with meal in the front. And always all, also come um, the same things as always, the, the, the two coins, the manual, the player's guide, the coin, the dice, the sleeves and... Uh, I, I don't understand, but one version showed me for me uh, 10, uh, 10 blisters pack and another one showed me 4. I don't know which one, I don't know the difference between, oh maybe it's a simple version one because one don't have a coin and another one have it, the coin in some sleeves changed too. Um, that's cool. Uh, also we have um, uh, Fusion Strike Mini Portfolio containing new artwork there. Gonna be if it's the mini, I believe it's gonna be like four slots for the card, so not gonna be that uh, much slot because I all my uh, all my cards uh, bins I have is for nine cards uh, space because like four are gonna be like be like lower and gonna you need to buy a bunch of them to be able to put a lot of cards. So for me, it's more easy to get the big ones for putting more cards collection because I have uh, one one by uh, one by just for. Holographic, I won't buy it for the V, I won't buy it for VMAX, I won't buy it for each regular collection. So 
that's normally how I fix my uh, I fix no I organize my collection. Can I put like the 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 holographs and you know, the uh, reversal holographs uh, in the semi uh, bind with the the main collection. So I always put like these different ones separate each other. For me, it's, it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool to, to look at. So basically, this we don't have yet any review for pre-orders. I don't know if we're gonna have pre-orders. We might just drop in the store. You just buy it because this collection is coming up in November 12th. So we basically like two months apart. So it's kind of very close to have pre-order. Especially tomorrow, we're doing pre-orders for the Pokemon uh, Celebration collection. So I'm not sure if this Pokemon Strike Fusion we're gonna be able to do pre-orders. If you do, uh, probably gonna be GameStop, Walmart, Target, all these places we know already. Uh, so um, just let's be smart, just keep checking uh, constantly if we have more um, news about this new collection coming in November to see if we don't miss the pre-order if they open. Um, I'm pretty excited for I love the set. It's, it's beautiful the set for the Mew. It's beautiful. I love this box. It might be my favorite box for Elite, uh, Elite Trainer box. It's beautiful. I love it. Especially the the battle, uh, the build battle stadium. The box is super cool too because I like the art they make with the Mew in the city. So with the Mew in the city is so cool. So that's all the video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys are also excited for the new collection coming soon. Drop in the comments what you think or what you expect for this collection. Don't forget to subscribe and drop a like to help me out and bring a lot of content for Pokemon. And uh, Final Fantasy is Final Fantasy Pokemon is my favorite franchise, so I'm gonna make, make content for both because I play a lot of Final Fantasy uh, 14 online. And now I'm playing a lot of Pokemon uh, Unite and I'm gonna start like Pokemon Sword and Shield I never played before. And the new two Pokemons uh, coming and uh, October or September, I don't remember. I think it's October. And then the Legend of Arcus in January. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And thank you for stopping by. And hope you see you in the next one.